It's going to be uh, not this hot for Community Cup. It's going to be okay. It's going to be a good day on Sunday as uh, Dan Dubo, Community Cup event director, is with us. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You pumped about it on I, Sunday? I'm ready to go. <laughs> uh, Victor Ogbechi is yep. with us and yep. uh, Edgar Musanda as That's well. Right. Good morning to all three of you. All set to play uh, some soccer. And this is the big the big sport that will be there. Not the only one, no. but the big one, yeah, right, Dan? It's the highlight. This is, it's, it's the sport that really brings people together. Yeah. Got, uh, something new. It bridges across communities, yeah, exactly. and you Around know what I world. love about it? It's so interesting here in the New World, mm -hmm. uh, in North America, the whole world is obsessed with soccer and is in love with the game, and we're really, I feel like, uh, just getting started. And that's what's nice when we have a, the immigrant population come in and bring the sport of soccer to life. And we're show starting us how to play. To, right, it shows <laughs> how to play. It's starting to really gain some ground uh, in Canada as a, as a great sport, and it's the most subscribed sport for uh, youth in Canada. So right. yeah. there should be a lot of activity going on on Sunday. Yeah, and it's, yeah. this, this yeah. is very recreational soccer. All abilities. Right. Uh, so it, it's... And Age groups. Age group. Well, we have a youth zone. We got uh, Capinari is going to be facilitating a, uh, you know, ages four to twelve for soccer, and then. But this tournament's all about fifteen and up. It's all about connecting people too. So Love that. Main, main reason. Connecting uh, new new Canadians, right? Yeah. yeah so what we the, the big uh, un, most unique piece about this event is that we really take the immigrants as uh, individuals coming here, not having any connections, and yeah. connecting them to the mainstream community. Right. And branching out, all communities, and vice versa, I imagine, too, the mainstream community that you right. speak yeah, of actually right. getting it's in touch with the immigrant community and, and helping to integrate themselves into that. Exactly. Community. So, yeah, yeah we're meeting so each cool. other, sharing each other's stories. And, yeah. And, 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 and yeah. it's like such a Canadian thing, isn't it? Yeah, you it know is. You what I mean? Uh, especially that Canadians are very welcoming and very friendly. Um, I mean, I've lived in Ottawa now for six months since I arrived. Okay. And, uh, and where did you arrive from? I arrived from Zambia, oh, um, cool. yeah, Southern Africa. All yeah. Right. yeah, I mean, soccer for me was a tool to actually get to know Dan, to get to know other people. And uh, if it wasn't for soccer, I would have struggled to actually get to understand the, the fabric of uh, Ottawa in terms of social life, in terms of you know uh, where to go and play soccer. That's just an awesome, uh, awesome way to, that soccer is the bridge for you. And, and Victor, uh, yep. you've had some fun with this. Have you been involved with the community for yeah, long? Yeah, uh, this is my second year. Okay. And uh, interestingly, it's been very good. Yeah. I really thank Dan and the organization for what they've done so far. You know, like. Um, Another thing you look out for is the fact that there will be a citizenship ceremony. I love that. At that particular, at, at, the, at the function on Sunday. We call it a function because it's, we look up to it. Yeah. It's something we've been working towards for a long time. It takes a lot of planning. And as I say, kudos to those who really uh, put this together, Dan to lead, and you know, it's wonderful. And it'd be interesting to see, I always think it'd be interesting to see the average uh, Canadian take their own citizenship exam. Hmm. <laughs> Would we do well? I, I will point out that this is, it, it's a actually full a full family event, right? Full, yeah, full family event, but the, uh, it's a reaffirmation ceremony, so everyone could participate in that. You, if yes. you, you could go and get your oath of citizenship. I like that, actually. I think <laughs> that's, a, yeah. what, it's actually yeah. an oath I've never taken, right? Yeah. 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 Which is interesting. Uh, I think maybe we, we should. Eat some cake. Yeah, uh, and yeah. then I also point out, yeah, it is a full gamut of all kinds of activities. We're out here on fake sports. grass for a reason. We're trying yeah. to point out the fact that clearly you're going to bring a picnic in the family yeah. and exactly. enjoy yourself. It's a picnic yeah. in the park for everybody. Yeah. You know, yeah. uh, we'll have the farmers markets on site, mm -hmm. so you come get some food, come and have a picnic park with the family. This is a Brewers Park. I should mention Brewers, Brewers Park. park. Don't exactly. Brewers, Brewers Park, park. Yep. just across from Carleton University. Yep. Uh, it's this is hosted by the Catholic Center for Immigrants. This, you know, this is the organization that, that, that runs this, and then it's this Community Cup is now eighth year in, in, in this, uh, this, sorry, eighth year doing yeah, this. Yeah, uh, that's uh, awesome. And um, demonstration sports, live entertainment, kids zone, puppet show starting at 10 a.m., uh, senior zone, uh, we, we have everything. It's, it's is there any fun at this thing? Is this fun at all? It very, seems very like much. it's fun. It's it more is. than fun. <laughs> yeah, I bet. It, it's, I mean, we've got other sports uh, going on as well. We've got volleyball, we've got right. rugby, we've got kids on. Kids can come and play. Yeah. Yeah. You know, parents don't have to worry about coming with uh, uh, two kids and not, you know, yeah. think where they are. But, right. you know, they know that uh, they're having fun with uh, one of our very entertaining coordinator. Uh, who's going to be running the, the kids zone. So I like that. Yeah. And they've also got to come down to learn how to do these things for free. We've, we've got people who are going to be Isn't training them, especially from soccer down to rugby, down to um, other games, cricket, yeah. 
rugby and the rest of them. And, so. uh, and uh, we're right out of time, but uh, a very cool um, demonstration sport as well that we've missed. Oh, Chin Loan, yeah. Chin Loan. The, the Burmese think, national sport, yeah. Isn't they, that amazing? Uh, yeah, so they'll be down there doing some demos and, and teaching people how to get involved. And you, you're not, it's not just demos, it's participating and connecting with, everything's about connecting. This right. is the, uh, this is perfect. We're right, at, right out of time, but I really love this, Dan. This is a good idea. It's the ideal that is, Canada is built on, uh, shaking hands with your neighbors and getting to know folks as well. Uh, and it's a very Ottawa idea too. So be there, Brew Park yeah. Sunday. What Sunday, time does it start? 9.30 in the morning till 4.30. All right, yeah. bring the family, bring the picnic and have a good time. And it uh, costs a, a bunch of money too. Oh yeah, it's Absolutely free. Oh yeah, it's <laughs> <huge>. yeah. <laughs>